Biden unsure when American hostages will be freed by Hamas? We don't know. Two dozen hostages were released Friday, including 13 Israelis, 10 Thai citizens, and one Filipino citizen. President Biden said on Friday that he was unsure when any American hostages being held by Hamas terrorists would be released after none was included in the group freed on the first day of the group ceasefire with Israel. We don't know when that will occur, but we're going to expect it to occur, Biden said while addressing the release of hostages from his vacation in Nantucket, Massachusetts. We don't know what the list of all the hostages are and when they will be released, but we know the numbers that are going to be released. So, it's my hope and expectation it will be soon, he added. He went on to say that he didn't know the condition of the Americans still in captivity or whether they were still alive. The release of hostages comes after Israel and Hamas agreed to a four-day ceasefire during which the terrorist group agreed to release 50 women and children taken in the October 7 attack on Israel in exchange for 150 Palestinians imprisoned by Israel. Two dozen hostages were released on Friday including 13 Israelis, 10 Thai citizens, and one Filipino citizen. The group was released into the care of Red Cross personnel, who were seen carrying those rescued via ambulance from Gaza into Egypt. The Israeli hostages were transported to Israel to receive care at various hospitals and are now accompanied by Israeli Defense Forces Special Forces. According to you, S. Intelligence. Approximately 10 Americans are being held hostage by Hamas. Israeli leaders have vowed to resume the war once the ceasefire lifts. Israel will continue its war on Hamas, and we will not stop until we achieve our two main goals, overthrowing the rule of Hamas and returning all the abductees back to us, safe and sound. Foreign Minister Eli Cohen said Friday as he toured Israel's ravaged border areas with his counterparts from Portugal and Slovenia. To date, there have been more than 1,200 Israelis reported killed by Hamas, while the Hamas-run Palestinian Ministry of Health is claiming that nearly 13,000 civilians have been killed from Israeli military activity in Gaza.